So here's how to draw triangles in Illustrator using some simple techniques. Let's just drag these up to the top here. If you're looking to draw an equilateral triangle where all the sides are even, you want to use the polygon tool. So select, click and drag out a polygon, and then use the down arrow key to get down to a three-sided shape. Hold shift to hold the shape in place, and then release. And there you have your equilateral triangle. Now, if you want to try and make an isosceles triangle where two of the sides are the same, we just make a duplicate here. You can use the direct selection tool. Let's select this top anchor point here and then click and drag and hold shift. And we can make that as long or as short as we like. For a right angle triangle, simply use the rectangle tool, hold shift, draw out a square, and then we're going to come to the pen tool, delete anchor point, and simply click to remove that corner anchor point, and then we have our right angle triangle. For a scaling triangle, again, there's a number of ways you could do this. You could use the direct selection tool and address different anchor points, or you can use the pen tool with your smart guides turned on, and then you can simply draw out the shape by clicking that works best for you. And then you can address the anchor points using the direct selection tool. This gives you more of a free form style triangle where you have control over all the sides. And then lastly, then if you want to round the corners of your triangle, say you want to do some icons or some softer artwork with less sharp edges, we just make a duplicate of this by holding out and dragging. If I go in with my direct selection tool and select this triangle, you see these little circles appear. What I can do is I can click and drag those, and that allows me to round my corners. If I undo that, and if I want to just do this on one corner, all I have to do is click and drag over the selected corner and click and drag that little circle. It will just apply that to one of the corners. And I can apply this technique to any of the shapes you can see on the screen here. So there you go. There's a very simple tutorial with several simple methods that will allow you to create triangles of all styles, shapes, and sizes in Illustrator. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Hope you found it helpful. Please subscribe. Turn on notifications, like and comment on this video, and let me know of any future tutorials or any issues you have in Illustrator or other Adobe software that you would like me to do tutorials for in the future. Until then, keep on designing, and I will see you next time for the next tutorial.